How are you holding up? Um, you know, I have I have okay days, and then I'll have really bad days. Um, I'm just waiting till I get to the part where I'm having good days. You know, and it's difficult because it's still early. He was just so tortured since our son passed. You know, he felt so much guilt. He just felt like he had failed his son. Are you going to get it out there? Are you going to, as an advocate for mental <clears throat> health awareness, where, what's your goal? What do you plan on doing? I am determined to keep talking about mental illness, the importance of our mental health, and how we have to change things. We need reform, and, and I'm not gonna stop. A lot of his fans as well have, the outpour of support that has been shown. How has that affected you? How great does that make you feel seeing how they've shown love and support towards all this? I ended up in the hospital after Kristoff passed on a 5150. With the outpour of support, I just felt like, okay, I can do this. I know that, they're on the other side rooting for me and counting on me to do this. I know you also said that you relapsed after 30 years with your sobriety. How are you doing now? Are you sober? I'm getting there. I'm getting there. I'm working on it and um, all I can do is one day at a time. One more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell. Never miss a video.